On behalf of the College of Family Physicians of Canada, welcome to the Family Physicians of the Year Award Ceremony. Bienvenue! With over 30,000 members and counting, the College takes great pride in all its members who define the specialty of family medicine in our country. Tonight, we are honored to celebrate 10 outstanding family physicians, one from each province, and present them with the Reg L. Perkin Award, which celebrates their contributions to family medicine practice, teaching, research, as well as special contributions they make in their home communities. Ils ont tous été proposés par des collègues, des membres de leur collectivité et leur section provinciale du CMFC en reconnaissance de l'influence positive qu'ils exercent par leur travail. Nous sommes ravis de remettre le prix Regel Perkin à ces médecins de famille accomplis et de leur rendre hommage en tant que médecins de famille de l'année 2013 au Canada. Now we are very pleased to introduce you to the Family Physicians of the Year for 2013. Dr. Tom Rimmer, Duncan, British Columbia. A dedicated rural family physician, Dr. Tom Rimmer was nominated by his peers for his leadership and commitment to providing exemplary care to underserviced communities. Dr. Rimmer received his medical degree from the University of British Columbia in 1995 and completed a rural family practice residency there in 1997. That same year, Dr. Rimmer received certification in family medicine and became a fellow of the College of Family Physicians of Canada in 2008. De 1997 à 2000, Dr. Rimmer a travaillé comme suppléant en Colombie-Britannique et en Nouvelle-Écosse. Il a ensuite ouvert son propre bureau à Duncan, en Colombie-Britannique, où il offre des services complets, dont des soins hospitaliers et obstétriques. Dr. Rimmer supervise des résidents en médecine familiale de l'Université de la Colombie-Britannique ainsi que des étudiants de troisième année inscrits au programme de médecine rurale et des étudiants de quatrième année inscrits au programme de médecine familiale. Among his many leadership roles, Dr. Rimmer serves as physician lead of the mental health module with the Vancouver Island Health Authority as well as a mentor of the Cowichan Valley Community of Practice through the Physician Information Technology Office, where he supports physicians transitioning into EMRs. Dr. Rimmer is a founding board member of the Cowichan Valley Division of Family Practice Society, which is part of a province-wide initiative to sustain and enhance primary care in the Cowichan Valley. This initiative was instrumental in the 2011 opening of the Cowichan Maternity Clinic, and the development of a hospital care program. Dr. Rimmer enjoys spending time with his wife of over 20 years, Mona, and their two children. He also enjoys spending his days off in his garden or on his sailboat. I am very grateful for this award. I love my work and am grateful for the opportunity it has given me to build long-term, meaningful relationships with my patients. The choice of a smaller community has allowed the kind of happy, healthy life-work balance we all strive for. I can't imagine a more fulfilling and rewarding career. Dr. Tom Rimmer, Canada's Family Physician of the Year for British Columbia. Dr. Hal Irvin, Sundry, Alberta. Known for his significant contributions in both rural practice and anesthesiology, Family physician Dr. Hal Irvin has recently retired following a career that spans almost 35 years. He earned certification in family medicine in 1979 and became a fellow of the College of Family Physicians of Canada in 1989. Après des études de premier cycle à l'Université de Calgary, il est entré à la Faculté de médecine en 1974. Il a fait sa résidence à l'Université Queen's en 1980 et a suivi une formation additionnelle en anesthésie, domaine dans lequel il a remporté la bourse de recherche Robert Hartley à deux reprises, d'abord en 1983 puis en 1990. En 1999, Dr. Irvin a travaillé comme médecin de famille et anesthésiste à Victoria en Australie dans le cadre d'un voyage d'échange de pratique de six mois. Pendant cette période, il est devenu membre associé du Royal Australian College of General Practitioners. Dr. Irvin has been involved with numerous organizations, such as the Alberta Medical Association and the Society of Rural Physicians of Canada. 
In 1988, he was president of the Alberta College of Family Physicians. From 1995 to 2000, Dr. Irvin served as clinical assistant professor at the University of Calgary's Department of Family Medicine. He was promoted to associate professor in 2000. Dr. Irvin was recognized as Clinician of the Year in 2002 by the David Thompson Health Region Medical Staff. In 2009, the Society of Rural Physicians of Canada awarded him with a Fellowship of Rural and Remote Medicine. When not at work, Dr. Irvin enjoys photography and motorcycling. He and his wife, Diane Fisher, have been married for 39 years, and together they have three children, Sarah, Bronwyn and Brody. Dr. Irvin also enjoys his new role as grandpa to grandson Sebastian. I've always considered myself just to be an average rural family doctor trying to do the best I can to deliver the kind of service to my patients that I would like to receive. To have that honored by my peers in this reward is very special to me. Dr. Hal Irvin, Canada's Family Physician of the Year for Alberta. Dr. Werner Oberholzer, Radville, Saskatchewan. Put patients first, always, is the motto of Dr. Werner Oberholzer, who is recognized for providing exceptional rural family medicine in his hometown of Radville, Saskatchewan. Diplômé de l'Université Orange Free State en Afrique du Sud, Dr. Oberholzer s'est établi en Saskatchewan avec sa famille. Il a commencé à pratiquer la médecine familiale au centre de santé de Radville avec sa femme Nelek, aussi médecin de famille. Il a obtenu la certification en médecine familiale du Collège des médecins de famille du Canada en 2009 et le titre de médecin gestionnaire certifié du Canada de l'Association médicale canadienne en 2011. Dr. Oberholzer provides weekly clinics in the communities of Bengoff and Pangman. He was instrumental in establishing the Rural West Primary Healthcare, an interdisciplinary medical team that cares for four underserviced rural communities in southeastern Saskatchewan. Dr. Oberholzer serves as Medical Director of Emergency Medical Services of Sun Country Health Region, Chairman of the Joint Medical Professional Review Committee of the College of Physicians and Surgeons of Saskatchewan and expert member of the Chronic Disease Management Program with the Saskatchewan Ministry of Health. He's also an associate professor at the University of Saskatchewan, where he mentors students and graduates of family medicine. In 2009, Dr. Oberholzer was honored as Saskatchewan Physician of the Year from the Saskatchewan Medical Association. In 2012, he received the Saskatchewan Healthcare Excellence Award from the University of Saskatchewan and the Dennis Kendall Distinguished Service Award from the College of Physicians and Surgeons of Saskatchewan. With a passion for skydiving, Dr. Oberholzer competes and teaches at the Moose Jaw Skydiving Club. He also enjoys spending time with Neliki and their four children, Aladia, Hoffs, Evert and Mia. Being a family physician is like being a thread that weaves together all the disciplines of medicine. And there is no greater trust people can show you than becoming your patient. In a fast-changing world, I strive to address my patient's need that is consistent and compassionate. Dr. Werner Oberholzer, Canada's Family Physician of the Year for Saskatchewan. Dr. Mark Dirksen, Steinbach, Manitoba. Dr. Mark Dirksen is recognized by his colleagues for his focus and exemplary leadership in family medicine. He demonstrates optimal patient care while carefully listening to patients and crafting solutions to their concerns. Diplômé de l'Université du Manitoba en 1988, il a obtenu la certification en médecine familiale en 1990 et le titre de Fellow du Collège des médecins de famille du Canada en 2004. Depuis 1990, Dr. Dworkson exerce la médecine familiale au Steinbach Family Medical Center, dont il est également président et membre actif du personnel. Il offre également des soins exemplaires à l'hôpital Bethesda. A preceptor to medical students and family medicine residents through the University of Manitoba, Dr. Dirksen was also involved in the creation of a clinical teaching unit in Steinbach. Throughout his career, Dr. Dirksen has been an active proponent of electronic medical records. He serves as a leader in the peer-to-peer -peer network, which assists physicians and clinics in their transition to EMRs. He has led the Manitoba Physician Integrated Network 
since its inception in 2006 and is on the steering committee that is implementing the first primary care network in Manitoba. A vocal proponent for continuing medical education, Dr. Dirksen has served as a question writer for the CFPC's self-learning CME program since 1994. In his spare time, Dr. Dirksen enjoys spending time with his wife, Kim, and their three daughters, Jessica, Heather, and Carrie, as well as participating in outdoor activities such as biking, tennis, jogging, and gardening. Being involved with patients and their families in Steinbeck, Manitoba for the past two decades and working in a supportive, dedicated, and enthusiastic clinic group practice has made family medicine an exciting and rewarding career. Dr. Mark Dirksen, Canada's Family Physician of the Year for Manitoba. Dr. Sarah Lynn Newbury, Marathon, Ontario. Dr. Sarah Lynn Newbury is recognized for her outstanding contributions to family medicine education and rural family medicine in Northern Ontario. Diplômée de l'Université McMaster en 1993, Dr. Newbury a obtenu la certification en médecine familiale en 1995 et le titre de Fellow du Collège des médecins de famille du Canada en 2006. Since 1996, Dr. Newbury has practiced comprehensive rural family medicine with the Marathon Family Health Team. She also serves as a Chief of Staff and a Chemotherapy Physician with the Wilson Memorial General Hospital in Marathon, Ontario. In addition to her role as preceptor for the Northwestern Ontario Medical Program, now the Northern Ontario School of Medicine, Dr. Newbury is credited for her outstanding leadership to the restructuring of the curriculum and assessment model. She made significant contributions to the first teaching modules, including session types, case content, and the Aboriginal Community Placement Pilot Module. Depuis 2008, elle siège au conseil d'administration du Collège des médecins de famille de l'Ontario, le CMFO. Elle a également présidé le Marathon Groundwater Stewardship Committee et le Peninsula Harbor Remediation Committee, qui a reçu un prix d'intendance environnementale en 2013. In 2009, Dr. Newbury's rural practice was recognized as Family Practice of the Year, one of two awarded by the OCFP that year. Her team practice was celebrated as Teacher of the Year by NOMP in 2002 and again in 2010 by NOSM. In her personal time, Dr. Newbury enjoys exploring the beautiful countryside in Northern Ontario, reading, knitting, and spending time with her husband, Alicio, and their sons, Ari and Matteo. I had the very good fortune of growing up with excellent rural family physician role models, not the least of whom was my dad, who over the years have been mentors, teachers, and trusting and supportive clinical colleagues. It's my hope that each of the physicians and colleagues with whom I have worked can see themselves reflected in this award. Dr. Sarah Lynn Newbury, Canada's Family Physician of the Year for Ontario. Dr. Michel Cochon, Québec, Québec. Depuis plus de 25 ans, le Dr. Michel Cochon jongle adroitement avec ses rôles de médecin de famille, de professeur et de chercheur à l'Unité de médecine familiale Mézeray à Québec. Diplômé de l'Université Laval en 1986, il a obtenu la certification en médecine familiale deux ans plus tard et le titre de Fellow du CMFC en 2002. L'initié attentionné et chevronné, il est membre du département de médecine familiale et d'urgence de l'Université Laval, d'abord à titre de chargé de cours, puis de professeur agrégé depuis 2006. L'innovation dans l'enseignement est sa passion. À ce titre, il est responsable d'Infocritique, un programme en ligne qui permet aux résidents de développer de façon interactive leurs habilités de lecture et de gestion de l'information scientifique. Ce cours est maintenant diffusé dans les universités québécoises et dans plusieurs pays francophones. He has won several awards for academic excellence, including an award for a teaching and research program on shared decision making in treating acute upper respiratory infections with antibiotics. Sought after for his expertise, Dr. Cochon has taken on a leadership role with many committees, including Laval University's annual Family Medicine Teachers Forum and the annual Pharmacotherapy Day. 
Il est également engagé dans la communauté médicale en tant que responsable de la qualité de l'acte de Québec Nord pour le Conseil des médecins, dentistes et pharmaciens et en tant que membre de l'Institut national d'excellence en santé et en services sociaux et du Comité scientifique d'évaluation et d'inscription des médicaments pour la province de Québec. Docteur Cochon et sa conjointe ont un garçon de 15 ans et deux filles âgées de 20 et de 22 ans. Durant ses temps libres, il aime jouer au tennis, faire du ski, voyager et lire. Alors, je suis très fier de recevoir ce prix qui représente pour moi une précieuse reconnaissance de mes pères, cliniciens, enseignants et chercheurs de l'Université Laval et du Collège québécois des médecins de famille. C'est à la fois un grand honneur et un encouragement à poursuivre la recherche d'excellence à l'exemple de nombreux médecins de famille à travers le Canada, que ce soit dans les soins aux patients, l'enseignement aux résidents et aux praticiens et dans le développement des connaissances de notre passionnante discipline. Docteur Michel Cochon, médecin de famille canadien de l'année au Québec. Dr. Jean McNeil, Moncton, New Brunswick. Known for fostering work environments where innovation is valued, New Brunswick's Dr. Jean McNeil has been a member of the College of Family Physicians of Canada since 1995. Dr. McNeil began her undergraduate degree at the University of New Brunswick in 1979 on the prestigious Beaverbrook Scholarship. A few years later, she received her medical degree from the University of Alberta and began her career in family medicine in Edmonton in 1987. Dr. McNeil moved back to New Brunswick in 1991 and joined the Horizon Health Network in Moncton, where she continues to work today. She's been the Medical Director for Family Practice, Geriatrics and Palliative Care since 1998, while maintaining a full-time, comprehensive community practice. Depuis 1987, Dr. McNeil est membre actif de la Fédération des Femmes Médecins du Canada, où elle a été présidente, trésorière nationale et administratrice. Membre de la Société médicale du Nouveau-Brunswick depuis 1991, elle en a été présidente sortante en 1998 et occupe le poste de présidente du Comité d'engagement des membres et des communications. Elle siège à de nombreux comités du Conseil de l'Association canadienne de protection médicale depuis 2006, de même qu'à divers comités et programmes gouvernementaux de sa province, dont le programme de dépistage du cancer du sein, le Comité consultatif sur les ressources médicales et, depuis peu, le groupe de travail sur le diabète. Dr. McNeil maintains a strong role in her home community. Since 2002, she has made presentations to local high school and community groups to promote healthy lifestyles. She was a director of the Home and School Association of Riverview Middle School, board member for Riverview Minor Soccer and the Riverview Tennis Association, and is currently president of the Legs for Literacy running event. Being a family doctor allows me to help patients when possible and to comfort them when not. I'm lucky to have been surrounded by amazing colleagues who have encouraged me to do my best every day. Dr. Jean McNeil, Canada's Family Physician of the Year for New Brunswick. Dr. Kathy Gallagher, Bedford, Nova Scotia. Making meaningful connections with people is at the heart of Dr. Kathy Gallagher's practice. Throughout her career, Dr. Gallagher's dedication and loyalty to her patients has guided her achievements in family medicine. Diplômée de l'Université de Lousy, Dr. Gallagher a travaillé au service d'urgence à l'hôpital Saint-Joseph de St. John au Nouveau-Brunswick pendant sa première année de pratique. C'est l'année suivante, alors qu'elle faisait des remplacements, qu'elle a découvert sa passion pour la médecine familiale. En 1992, elle est retournée à Bedford, où elle travaille présentement. The flexibility of family medicine is part of the appeal for Dr. Gallagher. She has had the opportunity to experience many different roles during her career. Currently, she's involved in clinic work and making house calls as part of her regular schedule. Over the years, she has provided obstetrical care, emergency room work, hospital care, and nursing home care, in addition to her office practice. Dr. Gallagher is particularly proud to be known as a doctor who really takes the time to listen. It is this combination of compassion and curiosity that aids her in identifying particularly challenging diagnoses. Membre du CMFC depuis plus de 20 ans, Dr. Gallagher s'est impliqué dans divers comités et conseils d'administration, notamment pour le CMFC, Doctors Nova Scotia et Capital Health. 
Cette implication l'a aidé à se familiariser avec les soins complets et globaux, la gestion des maladies chroniques et les politiques médicales. Elle a été présidente du Collège des médecins de famille de la Nouvelle-Écosse de 2004 à 2006. Dr. Gallagher has been married to her husband Doug for 20 years, and together they are the proud parents of Laura, 17, and Sarah, 15. She is actively involved in CrossFit, plays ringette in the winter, softball in the summer, and soccer all year round. I am very honored and humbled to have been chosen for this award. I represent the thousands of family doctors in this country who love their work and do their best to provide quality care and compassion for their patients. Dr. Kathy Gallagher, Canada's Family Physician of the Year for Nova Scotia. Dr. Robert Kelly, Charlottetown, Prince Edward Island. Known for going the extra mile and providing exceptional health care support, Dr. Robert Kelly is highly regarded by his colleagues and patients for his compassionate, hardworking and respectful demeanor. Diplômé de l'Université Dalhousie, Dr. Kelly a fait sa résidence en médecine familiale à St. John au Nouveau-Brunswick et Halifax en Nouvelle-Écosse en 1996. Cette même année, il a obtenu sa certification en médecine familiale. Il est titulaire de certificat en réanimation cardio-respiratoire de l'Université McGill. In 1996, Dr. Kelly began his medical career at Summerside Medical Center, where he provided comprehensive family medicine, including obstetrics and working as an emergency room physician at Prince County Hospital. In 2000, he moved his practice to Charlottetown, where he continues today, also serving as house physician at the Prince Edward Nursing Home and as a staff physician at the Queen Elizabeth Hospital, the Provincial Correctional Center, and the Provincial Addiction Services Facility. Depuis 2010, il est superviseur principal au programme de résidence en médecine familiale de l'île du Prince Édouard et enseigne à l'Université d'Arlausée depuis 2011. Actif dans sa collectivité, Dr. Kelly est l'entraîneur des ABs, l'équipe de hockey féminine de Charlottetown. Il a aussi été entraîneur du club de soccer de la ville pendant deux saisons. Since 2009, Dr. Kelly has participated in the UPEI Family Ambassador Program for International Students, a program that welcomes New Islanders into the homes of PEI residents for meals and a history lesson over the course of the school year. Familiar faces on the benches or in the stands, Dr. Kelly and his wife, Inga Dorsey, support their children, Kate and Neil, in all of their academic pursuits and extracurricular activities. He's also a huge fan of U2. It is an honor to be chosen by my colleagues to receive this award. I'm grateful for the many excellent role models I've had the good fortune to learn from, and I look forward to continuing to work in the ever-challenging and rewarding practice of family medicine. Dr. Robert Kelly, Canada's Family Physician of the Year for Prince Edward Island. Dr. Roger Butler, St. John's, Newfoundland. Dr. Roger Butler is recognized for his outstanding contributions as a family physician, teacher, and his dedicated work within the field of geriatrics on behalf of the Alzheimer's Society. After completing his medical degree and family medicine residency at Memorial University, Dr. Butler started practicing in Newfoundland in 1980. He received certification from the College of Family Physicians of Canada in 1980 and became a Fellow of the College in 1994. He was appointed Assistant Professor of Family Medicine at Memorial University in 1985 and Associate Professor in 1991. With a high level of expertise in geriatrics, Dr. Butler is often sought for his professional input on dementia, Alzheimer's disease, elder abuse and seniors care. He has presented on these topics extensively within Canada and abroad and is currently involved in a number of related research projects. Dr. Butler a siégé au Comité des soins aux personnes âgées du CMFC de 1999 à 2002 et en 2009. Il a présidé le Comité de vérification du programme de résidence en médecine familiale à l'Université Memorial de 1996 à 2012. En 2007, Dr. Butler a reçu le prix d'excellence du Collège des médecins de famille de Terre-Neuve et Labrador pour sa collaboration avec la société Alzheimer. En 2009, il a reçu le Goss Row Teaching Award par l'entremise du programme de résidence en médecine familiale de l'Université Memorial. In his spare time, Dr. Butler enjoys hiking, snowshoeing and ice fishing. He and his wife Christine have four sons, Matt, 
Phil, Greg, and Zach, and they recently became first-time grandparents to 15-month-old Claire. There are now lots of trips to Cornerbrook to spend time with the baby. To be a family physician means having the privilege to provide continuous comprehensive care to patients throughout their lives. The doctor-patient relationship allows me to experience firsthand the joys and sorrows of my patients' lives as I attempt to provide them with the best possible medical care. Dr. Roger Butler, Canada's Family Physician of the Year for Newfoundland and Labrador. It is a pleasure to acknowledge this year's Reg L. Perkin Award recipients for their outstanding dedication to family medicine and the significant difference they make in the lives of their patients, colleagues and communities. Ladies and gentlemen, let's join together to congratulate Canada's Family Physicians of the Year for 2013. Mesdames et Messieurs, joignez-vous à moi pour féliciter les médecins de famille de l'année 2013 au Canada. Thank you.